Hey makers, this is Thruveen and today I am going to show you the technique of how you can show your x-axis by hierarchy. I am going to provide you the better end user experience at the visualization level. So let's get started. But before that, if you haven't followed me on my Twitter and Instagram so far, please do follow me. So without further delay, let's get started. So here on here I am on my screen and here you can see that I have added one stack column chart and over here on the x axis I have added two columns state or provision and city and on y axis I am just added a value of sum of the employee. Now what I want to achieve here is let's say for an example this is my first level of axis. Now I am just going to my next level. Then what I want to show here is I want to show this axis value by hierarchy. So now you can see here by default what it does is it basically append the state character over here. So AK and then provision city. But you know this is very confusing for the end user when they are using this drill down feature. So now there is a solution for this problem. Basically, for any of your existing report which you have developed before September 2022 Power BI Desktop, you need to select your visualization, you need to click on format your visual and expand the x-axis. Over here, there is an option concatenate labels. Just turn it off and that will resolve your problem. Now, I am just going to the next level and here you can see that your axis values are properly hierarchical and it looks really nice. Isn't that cool? Now let me talk about the September 2022 Power BI desktop update over here. All the report that you have developed before September 2022 you need to follow this step. But now in future if you create a new report and add the similar visualization over here by default concatenate labels are turned off. Let's check that. So now let's say for an example, I'm going to create a fresh new visual. So I'm just selecting this column chart over here. And now let me just add state and number of employees over here. So I'm just dragging two columns over here. And now I'm just adding one more column to my X axis. And now let's check the behavior. And as soon as I added that column, you can clearly say that by default, the chart opened as a next level. And you can see that all the hierarchies are properly set. So that's the update for September 2022. Hope you like this video. If so, hit thumbs up and press the bell notification and subscribe my channel. If you are looking for any consultation, the website link is available here. And don't forget to follow me on my Twitter, Instagram and other social media handle. All the links are available on the channel cover right page. And don't forget to subscribe my another channel Digital Thruvin where I am uploading short content and Hindi content on Power Platform. With this, this is Thruvin signing off. See you in the next session with some amazing content. Till then, have a great day. Goodbye.